What's up YouTube and welcome back to my channel. And in this video, I'm going to be doing my game recap of Auburn versus Penn State. But if you haven't, please like, share, subscribe to the channel. And by doing so, it greatly helps out my channel and it helps me grow as a content creator. Well, Penn State traveled to Auburn and uh, they got the win, guys, 41-12. to uh, They completely dominated Auburn. Uh, Auburn was in the game at first, but uh, uh, Penn State was uh, just too much to overcome for Auburn. And I have the stats for the game, guys. Uh, Sean Clifford, you know, he went 14 for 19 for 178 yards, uh, but he didn't record a touchdown, guys. Um, actually, they didn't have a, a passing touchdown. They actually got all their touchdowns uh, by rushing. Uh, Singleton at running back, he had 10 carries for 124 yards and two touchdowns. Uh, like I said, he was just able to run the ball, guys, so very, very effective. Uh, and Allen behind him had nine carries and 52 yards and two touchdowns. So uh, they basically just uh, was able to move the ball uh, rushing. I was surprised uh, about that, guys. I thought Auburn was going to, uh, you know, be a little bit better at stopping the run. But uh, uh, Penn State proved to be able to run block very, very well. And uh, they were very effective on um, rushing in this game, guys. And then Sean Clifford, he had six carries for 15 yards and a touchdown. So they accounted for five touchdown, uh, rushing touchdowns, guys. And they had 245 yards rushing on the ground. So uh, pretty, pretty good for Penn State. Uh, there was the veteran team. I expected them to get the win, guys. And, uh, and they did, you know, playing at Auburn. Auburn is a hard place to play at, guys. And, uh, they got the victory uh, for Auburn, uh, TJ Finley. He was 11 for 19 for 152 yards. Uh, he had one interception. Uh, he, he struggles with, you know, passing the ball, and that was one of the reasons why I picked Penn State because uh, I think it was going to come down to quarterback play. And uh, like I said, Sean Clifford was a better quarterback over T.J. Finley. Uh, Robbie Ashford, he came in the game. He, had, he went 10 for 19 for 144 yards. And he had a touchdown, but he also had an interception as well. Uh, two costly, you know, interceptions, guys. You know, you know, Auburn wasn't able to to get a rushing touchdown. They had uh, Tank Bisby. He had nine carries for 39 yards. Uh, they completely shut him down, guys. Um, like I said, Penn State defense was pretty stout. Uh, they did get a rushing, I mean, a receiving touchdown. Uh, Jay Hunter. He had three receptions for 37 yards and a touchdown. Like I said, uh, Auburn struggles to, you know, pass the ball down the field. And they, uh, Penn State, you know, game plan around it, you know, stopping the run because, you know, that's Auburn's uh, strong suit. And uh, they basically shut them down. And um, they was able to do what they wanted to do, you know. Um, team stat-wise, uh, Penn State got 477 yards, uh, 232 passing, and 245 rushing. So, you know, they had the ball for 30 minutes and 22 seconds. Auburn had the ball for 29 minutes and 38 seconds. So, pretty similar. Both teams had about the same uh, possession time. Auburn got 415 total yards. They had 296 passing and 119 uh, rushing. But, uh, Penn State got the victory, guys, and uh, they pretty completely dominated uh, Auburn. Uh, once they got rolling, they were just uh, unstoppable, you know. And um, Penn State has beaten Auburn, you know, back to back, you know. You know, definitely Brian Harson has some work to do with Auburn, you know. If they want to be able to compete, you know, they have a lot of games coming up. You know, LSU. Uh, I think LSU comes to Auburn, but uh, you know, LSU looked pretty good you know, in their win, you know, uh, they still got to play Georgia. Georgia is a beast right now. You know, Georgia's the number one team right now. They, they're they playing good on both sides of the ball. Uh, you can't knock them. You got to give them credit, you know. You know, they still got to play us. You know, we're still working on things, but I expect us to be uh, in good shape by the end of the year, you know. So, uh, Auburn has a really, really tough schedule coming up, guys. You know, Penn State, they still got to go play. Uh, their games, Ohio State, Michigan, you know, uh, games in their conference. So it'll be interesting to see what both teams do moving forward. But uh, 
that's all I have for the stats, guys. Uh, and once again, guys, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And I'll definitely be back with more college football content. Thanks, guys, and roll tide.